postseason girls soccer takes us to East Aurora High School as the Naperville North Huskies face the Oswego East Wolves in the regional final. Naperville North starts on the front foot. Midfielder J.C. Sturrock's free kick connects with the head of Reagan O'Malley, but her glancing header goes just wide of the far post. The Huskies keep knocking on the door and their persistence pays off. A Wolves defensive error leads Cameron DeCook to get through on goal. She slots the ball past the keeper and gives Naperville North the first half lead. North continues to keep their foot on the gas. Rachel Noren controls the ball inside the box and lays it off for Issa Polavieja and her curling side-footed effort finds the net, giving the Huskies a 2-0 lead going into halftime. Naperville North in the second half looks to extend its lead as Noren is tackled in the box, leading to a penalty for the Huskies. Maggie Fitzgerald steps up to the plate and buries the spot kick to make it 3-0 in favor of North. Oswego East continues to battle as Erica Smiley heads the ball into the path of Anya Golbranson, who accelerates and scores with a left-footed finish to make it 3-1. Yet the Huskies put the game to bed as Catherine Ruan's through ball finds Annie Chang who puts the ball in the back of the net. Naperville North is the regional champion as it beats Oswego East 4-1. The Huskies will face Plainfield North in the sectional semifinal on Tuesday. We know that when we work hard and we um, battle for every ball and get the 50-50s in first and seconds that were really hard to beat. So we just focused on that and the rest kind of fell the way we wanted it to. Um, Rachel, like, she was like, <laughs> there's a bunch of players on her and the ball popped back and I just like took the opportunity to just hit it and hope for the best and it hit the corner of the net and it felt really good to get that second goal, kind of like securing the half almost. One of the biggest things is just, like I mentioned earlier, just our work ethic, how far that really takes us. Um, Gullit said we're a really hard team to beat when we all lock in and do the little things and I feel like that was really evident today. So we know Plainfield, we assume Plainfield North is winning right now. We know they're a good team um, and whatever team we face we know is going to be good in the next round. So we'll just go in and focus on ourselves and see where we get.